Robert, um, I had some clients in last week, and they were telling me that they had a long-term care policy, and I could tell by the way they said that they were thinking, oh, well, we're good, we're golden, we've got a long-term care policy, and I was telling them that they are not all that they are cracked up to be. No, they're not. I And I actually had a client this week that emailed me his policy, and you know, some of these policies, this guy, he's retired, but he's working to pay for the premium of his long-term policy, which is $525 a month. And long-term policies um, can be good if you're at home and you can get home health care. But the problem becomes if you have to go into a skilled nursing facility, you have paid years and years and years for this policy only for it to have to go into a nursing home because there's not one long-term care policy that will actually pay for a private pay skilled nursing facility because that's $12,000 a month. Most long-term care policies are $100 a day or $200 a day. And so the problem is, Tom, you've got this guy, that's someone that's paid a lot of money and there would otherwise be under income, but this person's long-term care policy was an income policy. So then that income is added onto his regular income. So then he needs a QIT to qualify for Medicaid because he's over income. And then all that money, so like almost $7,000 a month, goes right to the nursing home. Well, Robert, that's uh, what I'm thinking is that uh, these long-term care policies have given people a false sense of security that it's not going to do what they hope it's going to do. And you told me the premium was $500 a month. I thought I've heard of people paying a lot more than that per month for a premium. For the um, for the long-term care policy. Yeah, and this was just the one that I happened to look at. Okay. And um, so the that I, in my own world with my mom, she had a long-term care policy. And after I looked at it and I had our Medicaid expert look at it and it was advised that we not carry those payments because they were starting to be a lot of money. And the good news is the money that she paid into it, she can still get that back in long-term care. Um, so it's not like it's totally w thrown down the drain. She still has that income, that potential income. Well, the bottom line is with the planning that we can do here at the Olson Law Group, they don't need a long-term care policy because we have the ability to protect all of their assets from the cost of a nursing home. And that's going to be their home and IRAs and money in the bank as well. Yeah, and, and there's not, knock on wood, I mean, there hasn't been one asset that we haven't been able to protect and I would much prefer a client who's aging, who's spending $500 or $750 a month for this policy. That money could probably be better spent elsewhere. And I, I often think it's like the ultimate disrespect. You've paid so much money only when you're in crisis and you need help that the money's going to go to a nursing home. So you waste where if you didn't have it, you still would be going to a nursing home and you wouldn't have to spend all that extra money. If there's a listener right now out there that says, hey, I've got a long-term long -term care policy, and hey, they're probably just like me. You could pick up that policy and not understand a word about it, what it says, but would they be able to send it to you for a review? Yeah, they could certainly email it to me. And so with Medicaid, there's two types of long-term care policies. One is Medicaid will determine as income, which means that, yes, it will be considered income for a qualified income trust. And if you're, so if you go on Medicaid, it gets computed with your monthly income, would have to go into a qualified income trust and then pay a nursing home. Or the other type of policy is a reimbursement policy where it pays up to a specific amount every single month. And that actually the, the long-term care policy um, issuers they will pay the nursing home directly, so you won't even see that money. Got it. 